What's up guys? So today I just want to show you how to get rid of this extremely annoying spam that keeps on coming to our um, calendar app through OS X as well as iOS on our phone. So the first method is just to right click and then hit delete or decline. Now this is not recommended. Um, the reason is if you decline the message, it will tell the sender that you know behind the message there's someone else who is reading it and we are indeed receiving it. So I would not recommend this. Um, just to put that out there though, however, this is still a method. Now on the iPhone, if you want to just delete a message, you just go right in there and then hit decline in the bottom right corner. Again, that's not really recommended, so I wouldn't recommend you to do that. Another method is a little impractical. I know you, most of you guys do use calendars, um, but I'm still gonna present it here. This is to go to our system preferences. So you, you go into applications and then system preferences. And then you can go to your iCloud account and turn off the calendar. So you see here, if we turn the calendar off, all the messages disappear. Um, the problem with this is we're not going to be able to sync our calendars between our, you know, iPhone and Mac anymore. So I'm going to turn that back on because I know that's a little impractical for some of you guys. For those of you who only have an iPhone and not a Mac um, to turn off the calendars, we can go to our settings and then go to iCloud right here. In our iCloud, we can turn off the calendars and then we can delete from iPhone. Um, another method is to create a new inbox or a new folder for all the spam. Um, so we can hit calendars and then they'll bring up you know, our folders here, and then we can just hit right click anywhere on this left side, hit new calendar, and I'm just going to name it as spam two. You can see I've already created the folder. And then what we want to do is take each one of our spam messages, right click on it, and then hit calendar, and then put them in spam two folder or whatever folder you named yours. And then after you put those in that folder, you can actually just delete the folder and you can you now actually have an option to delete and not notify the senders so that's the most effective method i feel like to create a new folder in our calendar app we're going to go down to the bottom and you'll see it says today calendars and inbox we're going to choose calendars and then we're going to hit edit add calendar name it whatever you want and then we're going to put all our messages in that folder and then we could do the same process again. So then we're going to go into one of our single messages right on the bottom of the title. You'll see calendar. We can put it in our spam folder and then we can back out, go to our calendars again. And then from there, we're going to hit edit and then we can delete that calendar. And again, this method will not notify the uh, senders. And then the last option, you can go to your iCloud in a browser. So here's my iCloud opened up. I've signed in already. You can open up the calendar app. Um, and then what you can do from here is go to settings and turn off these uh, notifications. So go to settings right here in your left corner and hit preferences go to advanced and then instead right now you should see this checked in app notifications. Now you're going to want to turn that off and hit email. So what this will do is instead of getting a notification notification on your calendar app now, um, it will send to your email inbox and um, from there you can block that sender or you can um, mark the message as spam. So those are really the four options you have here. Um, this is just a new feature Apple came out with where people could send these invites. Uh, they just came out with this like November of 2016. So that's why we're seeing a lot of that right now. Hopefully there'll be a patch soon. Hopefully they'll fix it up or we could just, you know, even just right click these and then possibly mark them as spam. Um, other than that, that's really the only options we have here. I hate spam, and so I know most of you guys do too. 
um, but that really is the couple of options. Uh, if you found the video helpful, please hit that thumbs up button, subscribe to my channel, check out my other tech videos. I will see you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching.